The AI announcements just keep coming. Today is from ServiceNow, the fast-growing enterprise software player. This is the launch CEO Bill McDermott talked about at earnings in late July. And this one is important for investors to track because while there's a lot of jawboning out there about AI's potential to drive revenue, Salesforce and Oracle have their conferences this month, ServiceNow is leading the charge in releasing industry-specific AI capabilities. So if enterprise AI adoption does ramp the way some are hoping, this company could be an early indicator. I spoke with McDermott about how much spending customers will dedicate to IT. But if you just look at the independent research companies like IDC, for example, they have essentially said that IT spend, the growth rate will actually double next year. So from a growth rate, which is traditional of three and a half percent, 2024 will go to at least seven percent. And some people think even more because they're believing that many GNA functions will actually be budget uh, negative to fund and fuel the AI revolution. But if you think about platform as a service, the forecast for 2023 was 30%, and software as a service was 17% in 2023. In 2024, it's projected that that will go up substantially. So in our case, we are a platform, and we are a SaaS market leader, and IT spending is clearly going up, especially in AI, which gives us a bull case. When does it hit? I mean, for us, I'm expecting it to be earlier than others because we're actually launching uh, Vancouver, as you know, right now. And um, we'll be making even more releases in the fourth quarter. And in the first quarter of next year, we have our Washington release, which is massive new product introduction and innovation into the market. So I think, you know, you're going to start to see it late 2023, but in 2024, I'm expecting a very large year. I also asked Bill how he expects AI adoption to play out across different geographic regions. I believe Europe is going to be a big platform year in 2024 and beyond. And obviously Asia um, and markets in Asia now have to adapt to the cloud, have to buy into the cloud and capture this great tailwind. Because you know what? This isn't just like any new product introduction. This is like literally transforming your company. I mean, if you're an insurance company, you know, let's completely rethink the underwriting process. If you're a healthcare company, let's completely rethink how we care for patients. And instead of spending all of our time putting information into a system, let the system do the work so you can spend time with the patients. And if you're caring for a customer, you know, no longer do you have to be keyboarding information into a computer. That computer is there now with AI to serve you so you can serve your customers. So I think this is a revolution. It'll be global. U.S. is first mover. Europe is right there. But Asia's coming on strong.